This is Pierre Martin, folk artist. Welcome to another podcast from Pierre Martin, folk art, where myth come alive under the clock of night. Today we share a tale from the hidden glens where moonlight whispers and waterfalls sing, the tale of the friend of the moon. In a forest where waterfalls weep tears of joy and trees stand as ancient guardian, the friends of the moon gather. They are the keepers of the secrets of the whispers of lunar lore. Now, the poet clock in the night embrace recited the sacred verse. O oh, servant of the sky, your silver crown, bestow of hush upon the bustling town. In your ascent, we find our arts and winning with the eternal dance of the celestial kind. As the moon climbs, Jack the cat with fear as black as the space between stars stepped onto the ladders. With each rung, the poet's voice tread through the night a spell of words spun from the moonbeams and dreams. At the pinnacle, Jack, the master of this moonlight domain, gazed on the moon's radiant face, a silent conversation unfold. Dear Jack, with grace you climb to speak with me, you friends away below by the twin falls symphony. This year's I seek from you a humble deed, provide for you and yours the trout they need. Jack, with eyes like shimmers pools of night, nods. His descent is a silent promise to the glowing orb above. I load the sounds of the river to the awaiting friends. Jack announced the moon's desire. With one voice, they vote to give him trout, their pledge, sacred rites, to the cycle of nature. But what of the shadow figure draw to the secret society fame? His fate entwines with theirs, a tale for another night perhaps, As dawn first light peaks shyly through the leaves, the friends of the moon fade into legends, the legacy as enduring as the celestial body they adore. And Jack, he peers in the daylight, his belly full of promises and trout. Thank you for joining us in the forest's heart where story like the moons glow live on. Until next time, let the whispers of the forest guide you.